guys, Mark here. I'm going to do a quick video on how to correctly put on a rope halter. And, and there's some reasons why there's a right way and a wrong way. Uh, but first off, I want you to take a look at this right here. The nose band is in the proper position. The throat latch is in the proper position. The knot is tied properly below the loop. And the tail of it is tucked behind the throat latch and then down behind the vertical strap that goes down between the throat latch and the nose band. Okay, so here's one of the things that I see a lot of. And I'm trying to help everybody out there from looking like an idiot. Okay, I see this a lot where everything's just kind of hanging and the knot's tied above the, the loop. Okay, first off, this right here, if she put her head down to reach and scratch with her foot on her face, she, she may put a foot through there, and then you've got a real big problem, okay? The other problem is the nose bend here, hanging down past her nose on her nostrils, if that slips down past her nostrils, if she sat back and pulled or did whatever, then all you've got is a rope hanging uh, around the, the neck, and that's not good either. The other thing, too, is the the knot that's above the loop if she was able to sit back and pull real hard that would tighten up just like a, a shoelace knot it'd take you forever to get it off and uh you know in, in scenarios like that you want to be able to help your horse out the best you can as quick as you can so this is the not the right way anybody shows up in one of my clinics like this i'm like oh great here we go again so this is not good all right now for the correct way I want the nose band up where it's supposed to be, throat latch where it's supposed to be, not so tight that it chokes her, but not so loose that it falls down past her jowl. I'm going to put two fingers underneath the, the rope, the tail here, and then I'm going to go behind and then go underneath my fingers and then back through, hopefully you guys can see this, right there, and then I'm going to take the tail and put it behind the throat latch and then in between the two verticals that go down to the nose band por portion and the reason I do that is because if this was loose and she went to shake uh, trying to get flies off this could hit her in the eye we don't want that so you got to always think ahead and think about the what could ha you know what could be or what 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 may happen type issues but anyways that's how you properly put one on thanks a bunch we'll talk to you again